Hey everyone, it's Heidi. And my name is Zilla. <laughs> and welcome to this week's episode of Baby Name Sunday. So today's list, what are we doing? We are doing my baby names video today. <laughs> so we are doing Zayla's baby names she loves, but she will not be using for a while. Yes. <laughs> so we decided to pull together. She honestly created this list all on her own. It's about 25 names that are on Zayla's baby name list when she is older. Now let me tell you, you might be like, oh, trust me, she did well. I am so impressed. But before I get on with the list, if you guys haven't already subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button down below. Please hit the bell notification as well so you guys don't miss any of my videos. And then go check me out over on Instagram as well. So let's get this party started. Yeah. So my first name on the list is Norin. So that is Norin, spelled N-O-R-E-N. So this one's Old Norse originated, meaning North. Why do you like this one? Well, because it's like an, like an, like I like a name, because when I'm older, I'm gonna be using it. If I have, if I have like five kids. Oh, snap! Okay. And then for a couple nicknames, what do we have? We have like Norin or Lauren. Lauren? But what about Nori? <laughs> Nori, Nori as you well. Can do Nori or Lauren. <laughs> can do, so that's what the thing. The next name on the list is Leia. Alea. Alea. <laughs> I forgot that name. So that's spelled Alea. A L A I A. This one's a Basque originated name meaning joyful and happy. So why do you like the name Alea? This well, is nice. Well, like sometimes maybe um, when I if I have five kids, maybe I'll have six. <laughs> I have six or ten. Do you have any nicknames for Alea? Yes. What? You can do Leah or Leia. Ooh, okay. All right, so Zay has one more girl's name before moving on over to the boy side. So what's the girl's name? Aloran. Aloran. Spell A-L-O-R-Y-N. Aloran. So this one's a twist on the Hebrew name Alora, meaning the Lord is my light. Why do you love the name Aloran? Because, um, because I have a girl name in my class, Alora. So it rhymes together like Alora. So she created a Lauren, which I really like. It's like yeah. Alora plus Lauren mixed together. Well, for a nickname, it's Alora and a Lauren because it rhymes together. There we go. Moving on to my boy's name, I got Cleveland. Cleveland. I was so impressed. So this one's spelled C L E A V E. L-A-N-D, Cleveland. Now this one's an English originated name. Obviously it's a place name as well. I have no idea where she got this one from. <laughs> and it means hilly land from the cliff. But again, Cleveland, Ohio. I'm pretty sure that's the capital. I really hope so. But Cleveland, where did you come up with this? It kind of did in my head. I don't know, I just mixed it up, made that. I don't know. I, you I like it? Yeah, I don't know how I got it. I actually do not know. Do you have any nicknames for Cleveland? Yeah, you can do it Cleve or Clove or Cloth. Oh, Cleve, or Clove or Cloth. And you have Cleveland. So the next name on my list is India. She has India on her list. I-N-D-I-A. So India, again, is another place name. Maybe twins in the future, Zay. India and Cleveland. Yeah. They'll both be place names. Yeah. Isn't that perfect? And the name India actually means from the river Indus. Even you can do it Indy, and if I had if you know, I had twins, you can do Indy and Cleveland. Cleveland. For place name twins. Yes. India and Cleveland, nicknamed Cleve and Indy. And Cleve, Chin Indy, Cleve. So the next name on my list is Cleo. So it's Cleo, C-L-E-O. This is also on my, like one of my guilty pleasure names list, Cleo. I love it. Cleo's a Greek originated name meaning glory. Yes. Do you have any nicknames for Cleo? Well, she has nicknames for everyone. So you can do Cle or Cleo or Leo. Leo, oh, I haven't even thought of that before. Guys, Cleo, nickname Leo, what? High five, girlfriend. She's taking over baby name Sundays now. Another C on my on my list is Coden. Another C name on her list is Coden. Spelled so C-O-D-E-N. Coden. So this one's an old English originated name, meaning at the cottages. I actually really like Coden. What are the do you have any nicknames for Coden? I do. Okay, oh. You can do Code and Odin. You can do Code or Odin for yeah. nicknames here. Yeah, you could baby. probably do Coda as well yeah. if you really wanted to. Yeah, if you want. So the next name on my list is Posey. Posey, P-O-S-E-Y 
or you can do P-O-S-I-E. So there's a few different spelling variations. It's an English originated name, meaning a bunch of flowers. Zayla loved the meaning of this one. Yeah. What, I kind of have an idea, why did you choose Posey for this list? Well, Where did you get it from? Well, like on my on my um, iPad, I got like like sometimes I watch YouTube and the LeBrant fan and their little baby has ha, little his girl's name, name Posey. The little girl's name is yeah. Posey. Yeah, so that's how, your favorite one. Yeah, that's my favorite one. Posey. Posey. Even you can do a nickname Pose. Oh, Pose. Pose. We're going to vintage now. Her name is Marthy. Yeah, Marthy. We're going vintage right now. Marthy. Yeah. M-A-R-T-H-I-E. She totally made this one up. It's literally a mixture of like Martha and Ruthie. You have Marthy. So this one's a variant of the Aramaic Martha, which makes sense, <laughs> meaning lady. Is it one of your top names on your list? Yeah, it's one of my top names and I have like nicknames. Oh, okay, what's your nicknames for Marthy? Well, my nickname is Marth and Marthies. Okay, Marthies and Marth. So the next name on my list is Calestia. Calestia, spelled C-A-L-E-S-T-I-A, -E Calestia. Yes. So this is her complete invented play on the Latin name Celestia, meaning heavenly. What are your nicknames for, <laughs> what my, were your nicknames for this one? My nickname for this one is Calest. Calest. Yes. The next name on the list is Otis. Otis. O-T-I-F. I'm in love with your name, honestly. Otis is one of my favorite names ever for a boy. I think it's so, so cute. O-T-I-S. And it's German originated meaning wealthy. Why did you like Otis? Well, cause I watched a show named Abby and there's like a guy named Otis. Oh, and she got Otis. Like how cute is that? I have no and names. And then, oh, what's Otis's nickname? Well, Otis, I don't, he doesn't really have a nickname, but I have, I made up a nickname. Go for it. It's Odie. Odie! <laughs> <laughs> All right, and speaking of, you're talking about your show, you also have the name Bosley. Bosley is her other boy name from this exact show. So Bosley is spelled B-O-S-L-E-Y, and it's English originated, meaning meadow near the woods. I have a nickname for Bosley, and it's Boz. Boz. My next name on the list is Elena. Elena. So there's two spellings here. There's A-L-E-N-A -E or Elena with an E, E-L-E-N-A. So this one's a name of actually many origins. Spanish, Italian, German, and Greek originated, yeah. meaning bright, shining light. Wow, I love that. Right? And her nickname for Elena is Lainey. So L-A-I-N-E-Y, Lainey. Yeah. Number 14 on the list is Roxton. This is another one of my favorites, Roxton. So R-O-C-K-S-T-E-N, Roxton. Couple nicknames, we'll do that in a moment, but it means a stone or rock pebble. She completely made this up. She's like, mm -hmm. mom, put Roxton on my list with an E-N. And I was like, <laughs> And what are your nicknames for this one? Ro Rocky and Rocks. Rocky and Rocks. Like for like for a nickname, well, well Rocks is like, Rock on! The next name on the list is Movlin. Movlin, spelled M-A-U-V-L-E-N, Movlin. She completely made this one up. This one I try my best to find any information on. It's definitely made up by her. So it's a mix of the color mauve, which is kind of like a purplish color, which is one of Zayla's favorite colors. Yeah. <laughs> and she added len on the end, which actually means strong as a lion. Even I have purple on there. Yep, we yep. got purple and everything. Yeah. Tie-dye matching. Yeah, tie-dye matching. So are we called Movelin? Is this what you would call this? Movelin? Yeah. Movelin. The another color on the list is Emerald. Emerald. So she has Emerald on the list. E-M-E-R-A-L-D. Emerald. So this one's a gemstone name of Persian origins, meaning green, and it symbolizes loyalty, friendship, and uncontrollable love. Yeah. I can see Emmy for a nickname for Emerald. Emerald's like a mer a, mer a, a mermaid name. Oh, it's a mermaid name. Yeah, because I watched it in Mar Barbie and a mermaid was was had her had all her dolphins and one was named Emerald. Oh, that's so sweet! I didn't know that. Oh, and it was green. Yeah, that makes sense. It was magic. 
The next name on my list is Azria. Azria. This is another one, geez. A-Y-Z-R-I-A. Azria. So this one's close to many Hebrew and Arabic originated names actually, meaning helped by God. Azria. You can do nickname Ria or what? A's? Ace yeah. even? Ace for a girl. Yeah, even I have a nickname. Oh, for Azria? Okay, yeah. what's the nickname? So A's and A-Z. Oh, A-Z. That's cute. Look at you. A-Z. Okay, the next name on my list is Elvis. Elvis on the boy's side. Elvis, E-L-V-I-S. This one's actually an anglicized or anglicized, however you pronounce it, variant of the Irish name Saint Alby. So it was actually really hard to find any information on Elvis yeah. other than obviously Elvis Presley, which I feel like maybe that's where you got it from. Yeah, even I have a nickname. What is it? LV. LV. The next name on my list is Arietti. Arietti. So A R R I E T T Y. Arietti. This one's a literary name and it's also a variant of Harriet, meaning a state ruler. I watched the show with my dad, and there's like a tiny person like this tiny, and her name is Arietti. She loves anime just like her dad. Yeah. What's your nickname? Um, Ari. My little brother's name Aries, and it rhymes together Ari Aries. Ooh, so this one could be a potential honorary name for her brother. The next name on my list is Violet. Violet, spelled V-I-O-L-E-T. Superhero oh. name. What? It's a superhero name. This Violet is a superhero name? Yeah, like I watched this show and it has Violet in it. A little, a girl named Violet. And what is your nickname for Violet? Well, you can name it Vi and Vi Vi. The next boy's name on the list is... Million. Million. <laughs> Million. Big Million. Million, <laughs> M-I-L-I-A-N, Million. So Million is both a Spanish and Polish surname, meaning rival. Why do you like Million? I like this, this is well, edgy for your boy. Million is like really big. It's like a number yet you say, that's big million, really million, baby. My next name on the list is Rosie. Rosie, so R-O-S-I-E, Rosie. Where did you get Rosie from? Well, you can actually, I just got a Rosie from like roses. Oh. You can do roses. And but you thought you Rosie can do, was cool. And you can do rose. You can do rose? For a nickname. Do. Violet Rose you can do either. Is that like a first and middle name combo? Yeah. Ooh. Violet Rose. Speaking of combos, I got Sienna Moon. So speaking of combos, she has Sienna Moon. So this one's spelled S-I-E-N-N-A, -N -N Sienna, and middle name Moon, M-O-O-N. So Sienna is a place name. It's also the color of orange red clay, and then paired with Moon. I think I was scrolling one day through Instagram and I mentioned the name in general and she just remembered it. There's a little girl on Instagram, um, a mom that I follow, her little girl's name is Sienna Moon. And what's your nickname you for can Sienna? Also, you can also do Cece. Cece! Cece! All right, so we're on her second to last name on her list. This is a name combo and it would probably be really suitable for Sienna Moon's brother. What is it? Well, Sunset Jet, baby! <laughs> Sunset Jet, guys. She is extra today. This is a word name combo, yeah, meaning rocket into the sunset. Even have a nickname. What's your nickname for Sunset Jack? Yeah, and, you, and there's even a sunset outside that's there's sunning. Sun, right, this is perfect yeah. timing. Even I have a nickname. So you can do Sunny or Sunny Set Jet. Oh, Sunny Sunset Jet. Sunny Sunset Jet. <laughs> Yay, Dunny. That brings me to the last name on the list is Abby. Abby, A-B-B-E-Y, Abby. And this one's a Hebrew originated name, meaning my father is joyful. So she got Abby from Abby Hatcher, which is where she got Otis and Bosley, right? Yeah. Bosley, Otis, and Abby. So you yes. maybe would do siblings, maybe triplets? Yeah. Three babies in one? Yeah. So that is it with the list, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed Zayla's list here. She literally worked so hard in this. She's been working on it for like the past couple months here. Comment down below right here where the favorite where your, where your favorite name is. Kay. Comment down below <laughs> and message my mom right here. She always does her videos and I, this was my first baby names video, for real. Do you feel proud? Yeah, I feel proud of myself. Aww. Good job, Zay. All right, guys, we will see you guys next Sunday with another Baby Names list. Take care and stay safe. Bye. Bye. Peace out.